हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग आई एम धीरेन्द्र कुमार मॉडर्न इंग्लिश स्कूल न्यू एरिया सीनियर वे दिस इज सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ वीडियो लेक्चर फॉर क्लास एट सिविक्स चैप्टर्स नेम इज जुडिशियरी स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी विल स्टडी वाट इज इंडिपेंडेंस ऑफ जुडिशियरी वाट इज इंडिपेंडेंट जुडिशियरी स्टूडेंट कंसिडर अ सिचुएशन इन विच अ पावरफुल पॉलिटिशियन हैज इनक्रॉस्ड योर लैंड and that politician has the power to appoint and dismiss the judge from his office what will happen in this situation if you go to the court inclination of judge will be to ask that politician judgment would be in favor of that politic politician <coughs> in this situation judge cannot provide genuine decision because judge would be afraid of dismissal in this situation corruption may exist in our society judges cannot provide judgment well the judgment dear students to overcome this situation our constitution has given a provision for independent judiciary judiciary cannot work under the government judiciary cannot run according to the politician or according to the any powerful leader then how shall we sure for independence of judiciary student in chapter 1 we studied that we studied about separation of power separation of power means there is three branches or three part of government legislature executive judiciary <clears throat> separation of power means legislature and judiciary legislature and executive cannot work uh, cannot interfere into the work of judiciary 
judiciary can perform its action independently one other factor is also there to grant independence of judiciary that is appointment of judges dear students once the judges of high court and supreme court appointed they cannot be terminated it is very difficult task to terminate him and in the process of appoint appointment of judges of supreme court and high court there is very little role in legislature so that judiciary cannot be affected by legislature legislature is not responsible for the appointment of judges student what are benefits of independent judiciary there are two benefit of independent judiciary first is judges prevent legislature from misuse of their powers and second is judiciary grant fundamental right judiciary protect our fundamental right we knock the door of courts if we feel our fundamental right is getting violated i told you two benefits of independent judiciary first is it protect or it prevent legislature from misusing their power second it protects our fundamental rights we are free to move to the court if we feel our rights are getting violated students in this topic what we studied let me summarize this separation of power legislature and executive cannot interfere into the work of judiciary there is no role of legislature and executive in the appointment of judges and this made the judiciary independent judges can work independently because they should not be afraid of dismissal 
I told you that once judges of High Court and Supreme Court appointed, they won't be terminated. It's it's a very difficult work. And benefit of independent judiciary. Ju if judiciary is independent, they can take action against legislature. By this, they prevent legislature from misusing their power. And they also protects our fundamental right. That's all. Thanks. Stay at home to fight with Corona. Students, tomorrow we will study structures of the court. Have a nice day.